We have got the brightness back. 98.1 kilometers. It starts here, it goes all the way there. Sorry, sir. Here you can see crocodiles. But it's. Hey guys, uh, the time is uh, 4.26 The bike is all set, we have some issue with the headlamp uh, It is not bright, but that's fine, we have extra ox I think we can manage with that So let's start the ride Map, uh, it says Arrival time 12.27 And it's 489 kilometers more and uh, I think you can see the headlight uh, brightness. I don't know what happened. Uh, the brightness has gone. It used to be very bright. Uh, the headlight alone. But after the series wash, I don't know what went wrong with the light. Maybe there's some water in the in the lights uh, circuit. If it maybe if it gets dried, it'll be okay. But uh, if it doesn't, then we have these lights, so no issues. We can continue our ride. I need to uh, I need to refuel first. So we'll be going to the Shell petrol bunk, which is uh, maybe two two and a half kilometers away from here. We'll refuel then. We'll get going. We're not able to see the potholes. <laughs> so guys, uh, refuel. And we are good to go now. And uh, one good thing is, we have got the brightness back from the headlight. So I'm, uh, I'm happy about that. Reached uh, Krishnagiri. 98.1 kilometers it was full of fog and uh, it was very cold so that was the reason you know I didn't uh, I did not switch on the camera I think let me take a, a quick break here yeah. have this uh, peanut butter chicky so let's have this I mean let me have this Two minutes of uh, rest and uh, uh oh, stand. Had one chicky, two minutes of rest, and uh, we are good to go. What a beautiful view. The time is 634, 108 kilometers. And look at the fog. So much fog. Because there are more vehicles, I think the road is a little warm. So because of that, uh, you know, there is less fog on the uh, roadside. There's a dog uh, in the car. Looks like German Shepherd. This 
this is the 360 degree flyover it starts here goes all the way there joins the other uh, highway look at this it, it goes 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 where is the truck for heading to can you see the flyover it starts here it goes all the way there the time is uh, 750 755 and 214 kilometers I was driving little slow in between there were a lot of diversions they were uh, putting new tarmac so there it, it got little delayed but now it's fine I need to have uh, I need to have breakfast somewhere I'm not hungry yet but still I thought let me have it you know before uh, before reaching Perindurai Perindurai is uh, around 100, 110 kilometers from here so let me find a hotel and uh, I'll see you guys there found a hotel nearby <laughs> Hanapurna homely food let's see how is the food so guys uh, we have reached uh, somewhere near Perindurai and uh, had breakfast at this hotel I think uh, the video is focusing yep. had, uh, had good breakfast, had pungal breakfast was good and, uh, so let's start the ride now Kaveri river looks so beautiful man so beautiful I think some uh, temple function there are so many people man wow I've reached uh, a place called uh, Chennimalai and total kilometers is 306 kilometers and the time is 9.30 I took uh, 10 minutes rest when I took uh, the exit from highway and I think I need to refuel again done refueling uh, I did not uh, I thought the camera was on but uh, the camera was off uh, I forgot to press the uh, on button I have filled uh, again for 700 rupees what a beautiful road so many diversions dude so many diversions but this diversion itself I have lost around 40-45 minutes everywhere diversions This is not how you break. this camera <laughs> I was like recording the video I wanted to hold it here some of it managed to escape from my hand by luck I caught it again I've reached 364 kilometers almost 90 to 80 kilometers I need to ride taking a small break both of us I need to get some chocolates Guys, uh, reached Udumil Pet, which is uh, hello, hello, huh? Hello. 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 Hello.
Gitu ya. Actually I met my cousin even he was coming to our hometown. It was a surprise meeting him. He said that he's uh, coming home. I thought of taking him in motorcycle but motorcycle is fully packed. The bag which is behind me is very heavy. Uh, so he cannot uh, so even he cannot hold it and uh, sit. From here uh, the guard section starts guys. First one security check is there. Oh my god. There is no shops. I cannot get water here. Fine. Sir, sir. So we have entered the, the guard section. Here, here there are a lot of animals like uh, elephants, tigers, leopards, deer, a lot of varieties of snakes, monkeys, uh, bison, and a lot more. So that's the reason he said, uh, "Don't stop anywhere in between." Hope these guys leave me some way because this is a this is very small road. We cannot overtake easily. Unless uh, they give me some space. Here we should not honk, so we'll just wait for them to give way. Still, this is Tamil Nadu, not Kerala. Kerala is after uh, the check post, after few few kilometers. This is a dam. Here you can see crocodiles, but it's very rare. Oh, sand. And many people ask me why, uh, why multi-axle buses don't come this way. Uh, there's a reason. I'll show you that. This road is very narrow, that is one of the reason. And uh, and uh, the main reason is this turn. Can you see this? Can you see the mark? This is this was done by even a normal even a normal bus you know uh, finds difficult to turn on this both the turns this turns are very narrow if you get the multi axle uh, bus in this route it will definitely not work out there will be a check post here this is the tamil nadu check post this is the second check post but bikes can go I hope they have not changed the rules. They have not uh, changed any rules. And here is one more check post. How? Camera. Camera. How? The dress on. Okay. Plan. Okay. Thank you. So you need to be careful with those monkeys. And this check post is mandatory. You need to sign. There's no other go. Here. My God, the monkey took this cover <laughs> and dropped it here itself. So I'll take it home and put it in the dustbin.
Okay, yeah. And I told you there are tigers and leopards. Uh, it doesn't come. It doesn't come to the road on daytime. Night time, you can expect it. Oh, 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 the stones. Did you see the drift? That driver is simply drifting the truck. <laughs> It would be even more good if uh, the roads were smooth. Bike goes like this. I think I need to stop uh, the bike somewhere and show you the view. I think this will be the right place. Did the bike stand? Yep. Can you see this view? I think I'll take the DSLR, that will make sense. Okay. Um, <coughs> oh, oh my god, look at the trash. Even here, these people have thrown all the trash. Starting from alcohol bottles, cake, chips, whatnot. Yeah, where is the zip, dude? It's here. Mm. Got it. Even I need to take a uh, look at this monkey's footprints. This is the view, guys. I'm recording this with the kit lens, so will not have, uh, so will not get that much clarity. I have the other lens uh, in the tank bag. They said it's cold here but I'm feeling warm. I'm little bit sweating inside. I'm not wearing thermal liner or anything. Here they should have the bison's uh, complete skeleton. I don't know whether we are allowed to go there. Can you see that? It's a bison's skeleton. And this is the world's biggest tortoise. <laughs> it's a shop. Just kidding. Actually, today I'll not be going to Munar uh, because it's already 12:30, and I'm I'm very tired. If you're a new subscriber, then this is how I need to go to my home. Because, uh, They're going to make some road or something here, I guess. I can't take the bike. It's very difficult to take the bike. Da, pre, pra. See what other people are going to do. 
Look at the view. And here there are mountains, but uh, Okay, my brother says there's a waterfall there. Let me go there and take a look. It's all wet and we came further in and this is all we could see.